can. Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right, sorry. Thank you. Oh, on the other side. Okay. All right, thank you. All right, guys. Today we're gonna go somewhere super cool in the valley. We are going to Starbase, Texas, and yes, that's where SpaceX and Elon Musk are launching their rockets from. So I'm really hoping to get a footage, some footage of Doge One. Now probably not gonna be the same rocket but I mean close enough right so uh, it's gonna be about two and a half hour drive or maybe two hours more or less so let's see what car we're taking we're taking the Pleiades Subaru the pineal gland penny cafe TV have a sip with me You know, actually I really like this taste of San Antonio stuff it's like so good it is a K-Cup from your local H-E-B Cafe Olay. This stuff is pretty amazing, I'm not gonna lie. I also have another one called Hazelnut something or other. That one's pretty All right, amazing. guys, so I just left Nana's Taqueria and I just picked up something pretty amazing. So if you guys are interested in ever coming here, it's on 1015 in West Laco, Texas. It's close to Military Road and look what I picked up. I'm gonna be munching on those on the way over to uh, Starbase. So this is pretty famous, they got some cool stuff, so you guys need to right, guys, check so that So these are what you call lonches, just little 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 buns really, with uh, with some bistec, which is, what, which is short in Mexican for beef steak, and it has a tomato, avocado, goat's cheese, onions, and they're pretty freaking delicious. You see this road right here is 1015, and it'll take you directly into Mexico, uh, the international border. It's called the uh, Progreso, it's the city that's on the other side. So yeah, honestly, you guys need to try this. You're missing out. So here from 1015, we're making a left onto Military Road, and this road will take us directly to Brownsville. And uh, Military Road will eventually turn into Boca Chica, Boulevard. I, I really hope I'm going the right direction, but uh, pretty much just take this street directly to Starbase. <laughs> It'll be about uh, so the valley is just really one long expressway, and then military is kind of uh, real close to the Mexican border, and it, it kind of mirrors the, the, the major expressway down here. So we're, we're set to just go here right now. Uh, I think there's a few things that I might want to show you, like the border wall. You can see, like. It's really more like a border fence and then uh, we'll, we'll have a stop at, at there's a cannon if it's not being a, uh, if there isn't any construction around it uh, we'll, we'll stop and check that out real quick. Yeah, so I think that the idea behind these things is that they're supposed to be messy uh, that is just about every spot on the way down <laughs> Maybe I should do some ASMR videos with lunches. <laughs> so this is a cannon. All right, so let's see. So this is Thornton, Thornton Skirmish, April 25th, 1846. I'm not sure if you guys are able to see that. Uh, cannon placed by Lieutenant Thomas Barlow, uh, chap, chap, ch Lieutenant Thomas Barlow chapter. Oh, okay. And, uh, the spot where American blood was shed on American soil, April 25th, 1846. Here, Captain Philip Thornton and the 62 Dragoons were attacked by Mexican troops, erected by the state of Texas in 1936. Wow. Man, so this thing's been here for a long time. See, it's, it's facing Mexican side. All right. It's going to be an interesting night. All right, let's go. I actually have a picture of my wife sitting on that cannon. It was from when we first met. We did like a, a historical Texas marker uh, hunt. It took us forever to find, you know, just a few, but like, like we had this crazy idea about finding all the ones in Texas. And then we found this app that, that just pretty much, uh, what's it called, uh, displayed them all for the state of Texas. And we realized hey, it's a little more than we can handle. So I don't know if he's actually done it yet, but Elon Musk said that he was going to give $30 million to Cameron County. 20 million of that was going to go to the schools and 10 million of that was going to go to help revitalize the historic Brownsville area. 
Now, Elon Musk is serious about turning Starbase into its own city. Now, you can imagine it being some sort of like mecca for high tech. So he's he's actually urging people to come down there and move. So, I, I mean, this is the time to learn about the RGB. You know, I think all that he would have to do is just apply with the county for his city license or what have you. And uh, he has access to a humongous, affordable workforce, mind you. <laughs> uh, so uh, I think this is a really good move for him. Um, and uh, I'm just thinking about it. This is military road and it goes directly to Starbase. I mean, he also has access to the maquiladoras here in, like near Mexico. So that means um, he, he can get just about any part he wants from here. Dang it, I'm almost out of coffee. It's been a pretty eventful ride. Uh, it's been pretty empty though, like there's absolutely nobody around. If you look, I don't know if I can focus that, but there's like nobody behind me. <laughs> oh, there, you can see uh, the border fence off in the distance right there if you zoom in. And uh, it's just like a big old gap right there. And I guess there's still this, actually, this part of the fence has been up for a very long time. I think even uh, it went up during Obama, maybe even Bush, to be honest, because I know that uh, that wall has been present down here for a long time. Okay, here in the border wall is a little more obvious. Uh, not sure what part of that it is. Oh, here we go. As you can see it. So Mexico isn't like right there, but um, it's kind of extended. So this is the UT RGV Stargate. So you guys want to work for uh, Elon? You guys should probably join this school, man. This is freaking crazy cool. Okay, we still got a little further to go. I don't want to feel like I'm freaking blocking traffic here or anything. UT RGV Stargate. sort of satellite array.
Damn guys, I can't believe I'm like this close <laughs> to the rocket. So this has to be Doge 1. And uh, dude, that means that Elon Musk has been on these grounds, right? Like that is just super freaking cool, man. Like I can't even tell you. I could literally just sit here and look at it for a while. <laughs> So I suppose that kind of looks like their little capsule one, the one they test with. Uh, I could have sworn I saw something like that. I'm not sure, maybe this is like their, their lunar lander or something. But yeah, there's like a ton of cranes everywhere. I'll head off back that way and check out the UTV, UTRGV Stargate one a little bit. Man, that's just so cool. Boga Chica Beach is just down the street here. I did a, a U-turn. So this puppy is going to go all the way to Hawaii. It'll be SpaceX's first attempt at an orbital flight. Dude, that's going to be freaking cool. I don't know how true this is, but I don't know if other people from the area would remember, but when they were doing construction for one of these two sites, they came across some ruins now we're talking like some sort of like mayan ruins or something and uh what's called uh so if you can imagine if they actually came across something like that they would have to scrap the entire thing and move the program all the way to wherever whatever, whatever other location was in the running i'm thinking it was maybe corpus or something i don't remember correctly but i cannot find that article anymore now i know i read it i know i screenshot it and i know i know send it to somebody else and but I can't find anything. If somebody finds it, leave it in the description so that so that we can all look for it. So that's kind of crazy, though, yo. Like, I mean, whatever, dude. <laughs> Damn, guys, this is so freaking badass, dude. Doge one to the freaking moon. <laughs> God. Right now I'm just sitting here and uh, I'm waiting for the sun to go down so I can go take uh, uh, some pictures and videos of the Starbase sign all lit up. As you can see there's still there's already people like me, you know, <laughs> just wanted to take a picture of the rocket. <laughs> Oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> All right, sorry. Thank you. Oh, on the on the other side. Okay. All right, thank you. Okay, so for anybody coming out here, uh, you can't actually park on the white rocks down there, but you can park across the street here and uh, and uh, take videos or photos or whatever. But. You guys had as much fun as I did today. Uh, the guy was being super cool about it. He wasn't being rude or anything. Uh, but yeah, you guys should definitely come back and uh, come for the apps and stay for the rest. So thank you for having us sit with me. <laughs>